Hello today, and today we're going to have a game of Sito Pun's 500cc Grand Prix, or in this case, on the Spectrum, it seems that it's just called Sito Pun's 500cc, as I said, on the Sinclair ZX Spectrum. Now, I have just reviewed this for the Amstrad CPC, and it looks like my suspicions, suspicions were correct that the, the CPC was a Spectrum port. Well, the CPC had Spectrum sound effects, so I'm only assuming, I've not played this version yet, but I'm only assuming this is going to have the same sound effects. Right. So, the menu layout looks sort of the same, so except for we got Kempston instead of joystick, so we're going to choose Kempston because I don't know the keys. So difficulty at the bottom is free. Toto, I think he's keyboard. And as uh, he's continuing, it's a Spanish game only, by the way. Um, now, because I have played the CPC version, I know exactly what happens here. Now, don't push two, something weird happens. It goes into some text mode and I couldn't get out of it. So I'm not going to choose that mode. One is Carrera means race or qualify. Um, and that you can race on any circuit. You can choose whatever circuit you want. Zero is sort of like a full Grand Prix. And what I'm going to do, just to show you, I'm just going to go push one. And now you can choose your circuit. So I'm assuming we've got exactly the same circuits on the CPC. So let's go to Salzburg, Salzburg Ring. Um, let's just see how. I know exactly, it's going to play sort of the same, I'll just know it. Right, so we've pushed one. Right. Yes, it's exactly like the CPC version, except for this version goes a bit quicker. Still jumpy jerky. Oh, and I've fallen off my bike. Hang on a minute. With the CPC version, you fall off your bike. That's it. It was go You could say it was game over, but this version, you got get back on your bike. Oh shit! No, right. Now there is a difference with the Spectrum version. If you slide off you can get back on it. If you crash it's game over. But the CPC version did it differently. It showed you the rest of the track when you when you basically fell off your bike. Or crash your bike off. So it's pretty much the same thing. You only get... Well I think if you slide off then you get another go. If you crash that's it, game over. Right. So, let's have another try on another track. Um, so, let's... Oh, you can't, hang on, I can't. Why can't I change the track? Right, okay. So, let's go to... Um, zero. Let's choose um, one again. Let's choose zero. Let's... Um, Donington Park. Let's try that. Order shop. Right, so we push one. So you push forward to accelerate. Oh! You push forward to accelerate. Oh! Right, I've slid off. So if you slide off your bike. Now it's doing what the CPC version does. It's going to, now I've crashed, it's doing what the CPC version does and that's preview the rest of the track. So if you slide off your bike, you get another chance. If you crash your bike, then that's it, it's game over. And you can't get out of this, you've got to sit through and watch the fucking track preview. So, 
once again, if you're going to play this game, I would recommend put it on practice. And it even shows you the gears you're in. Yeah, it's just I don't like that. You know, if, it seems definitely faster than the CPC version. As I said, the CPC was a fucking port of the Spectrum version. But it's it's still not very good to play. Honestly, if I'm going to choose a version, it'd probably be the Spectrum version. Right, what we're going to do, we're going to have another try. And this time, right, let's see why I can't choose the track now. So even if I want, but I'm not going to go, I'm going to push two. Now we're going to push zero again. And this time we're going to put three, which is practice. So now we can practice on whatever circuit we choose. Salzburg. Let's let's try that. And let's go to let's push one. So now what I can do is crash as many times on my bike. Oh fucking hell, I can crash and even if I do crash I can get on my bike because I'm practicing. So you gotta wait till the red builds up, then it just goes. <sighs> yeah, this is not this is not good to control. It's very it is very jumpy jerky. It's not as bad as the CPC version. But I still wouldn't recommend this, it's not very good. So you can practice on any track which is available, or race on any track which is available, or you can do a Grand Prix, but why the fuck would you if you're only going to get limited charge? If you crash your bike, that's it, it's, it's game over. And this is the same problem where I had with the CPC, it fucking restarts you where you fucking crash. Fucking now. Oh right, so oh that's clever that. That's extremely fucking clever. It, it, it ain't like a normal game where it puts you back on the track. No, you gotta find your way back on the track yourself. This is an awful game. It really is an awful game. Fuck it now! Oh, can I just cut the track then? Clearly, you can just cut the track. And it registers as a fucking lap. Even though I've cut the fucking track, it registers as a lap. Fuck it now. This is awful. This is awful. I mean the graphics don't look too bad actually, but that's about it. And I do believe it's only a 48k game only. And I was even too fucking lazy to put fucking AY sound effects on the CPC version. Break! Is it gonna break? Oh, it breaks it. Fucking breaks work then, just about. Turn! I didn't even touch it! I don't like this game. I'm not playing it no more. Um, it's shit. It's absolutely shit. Um. The controls are very jumpy jerky, sort of the motion of it is horrible. Yeah, controls can be a little bit unresponsive. Um, well, I'll say it's jumpy jerky, the fucking game's jumpy jerky. Uh, obviously it makes the controls really difficult to respond at times. Yeah, it's just not a very good game. It really isn't a good game. Yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't recommend it. 
anyway, I'm going to end this now. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time, and goodbye.